Hey guys, what's going on? Welcome back to another daily video. So today's daily video, uh, just before I start, I forgot to mention that, just before we start, if you guys have not seen the prank video from last night, go check it out before you watch this video because I'm going to be talking about it a lot during this video and um, during this walking vlog. And um, yeah, we are going to be talking a lot about this prank last night during this walking vlog. And I don't want to spoil anything for you guys. So if you guys have not seen the prank video yet, go check it out. It is it is called My Dad Pranked Me Really Hard with um, Angry Emojis. And uh, yeah, I'm going to get him back for doing that. Pretty bad. As bad as he got me back, I'm going to get him back for that. So without further ado, let's start this vlog. So, how has your guys' weekend been so far? Mine good until I got scared half to death last night. Um, I actually thought my dad was insane for a while until in the middle of the prank around six or seven minutes, I knew he was pranking me. So I thought I heard laughing when I closed my door when I was back in my room in the dark. I actually thought I heard laughing and then I was like, nah, he can't. I was like, is he pranking me? And then something came to me like, oh nah, he's not pranking me. There's something wrong. But on the one side of me, something telling me he was pranking me. So the second time I heard him laughing, that's when I opened up the door and I caught him. So that's when I just tagged along. I played along, pretending I was scared. But for like the first six or seven minutes, I was petrified and terrified that he wasn't kidding. So, um, everything in that prank is fake, though. Everything in that prank is 100% truly fake. It is 100% truly fake, I promise. If it was real, yeah, I would have done something about it. But it wasn't real. We were just having some fun. But for a while, I thought it was real. I thought, because um, my dad is kind of like a spirit talker. He talks to spirits and stuff. I'm not going to I'm not gonna say the name of it, but some of you already know what that is called. Um, so I'm going to let you guys figure it out. He can talk with spirits, though. Uh, he sees them in his sleep and everything. He's a... Uh, no, I'm just going to say it. Um, my dad is a shaman. There we go, I said it. I really hope he doesn't mind me telling my viewers that he's a shaman. So, um, yeah, so for a while there, because I've seen all sorts of crazy, crazy, uh, you know what. I've seen all sorts of crazy stuff happen in that house. And um, the craziest things I've seen happen, you guys don't want to know. But um, if you guys were in my position, you guys would know. Because for a while there, I actually thought he was, like, possessed by a spirit or something. Because it was freaking me out. And, um, yeah. I'm sorry I'm not so focused in this vlog today. Um, I woke up. I got, I fell asleep around, uh, fell asleep around 1 a.m. And I woke up at noon. So I'm kind of a little disoriented still, even though I've been walking for 25 minutes. It takes me at least an hour to fully get back into shape. But, um, yeah, when I step outside, it takes me at least an hour to get fully back into shape. It's only been 25 minutes. So, um, yeah, just also to let you guys know one more thing. This is going to be the last, the last walking vlog with Vlogstar for a while. Why? Because I'm just that type of person. I want to create my own humor. So this is going to be the last vlog with Vlogstar for a while. Maybe about a week or so. But um, I know you guys love Vlogstar so much. But um, I'm going to eventually bring it back. Bikers again. Here's bikers again. But um, yeah, we're coming up on the Homewood Metro Station now. I don't even know what this... Uh, I don't even know if this is like a condo or something. This house up here. Either th either this person owns all three of these balconies and everything and lives in that. That big house right there. That big brick one. Which I doubt it because that actually does look like an apartment. And I'm not kidding. That is a big, big, big apartment. And that's, That would be a great view to see the trains. From there to there. That would be a great view. God, the wind is crazy. Not as crazy it has, not as crazy as it has been though. Can we walk across that bridge over there? Let's see. It's a bridge over here. It's 
Sundays are usually not so active for me, guys. That's why that's why I'd rather do walking vlogs on Sunday. But most of the time I did them on um excuse me for a minute. Twelve hour parking, two twenty five, deposit money at pay booth at station entrance. Remember your space number. Stop exit only. Okay. There used to be like a little toll right here. You could put your ticket number and everything in. But they stopped doing that. I'm pretty sure you guys saw it. It's right there. Yeah, right there where I pointed. That little thing with that big hood. Looks like a uh, crosswalk thingy. It's used to, um, it's like a pay booth. It's a pay booth. To get into the, uh, and they used to have a little handle that would go down like this. You know how like one, like, like those toll booths do? A handle would go down? Yeah, it used to be like that because I remember when I was young. So, um, I'm going to tell you guys a lot of different things. First, let's walk across this bridge. Never walked across this before. Oh my god, I felt like stairs. Oh my god, this would be a great place to rail fan. I'm not kidding. Guys, imagine, just imagine, standing right here when a metro comes in. Holy shoot. That'd be a great shot, but the only problem is that the fence is in the way. That's the only problem I have is that that fence is in the way. But I mean, this way would be a great shot. Go right down there. See where those rocks are? There's no fence down there. There's no fence past that. So that'd be a great shot. But the only problem is that it's lower. So it'd be harder to get a open shot of the train coming in. But if it was just as low as this one, it'd be a great shot. But I'm going to try that later this week. Um, tomorrow. Uh, that, yeah, tomorrow. Because the schedule, I don't know if you guys know it or not. I don't know if you guys have seen the past Metro videos where the schedule's changed from my train videos. I'm just going to let you guys know now that the schedule has changed at least, at least until coronavirus is over. I'm always going to let you guys, dang, look at that SRT Hellcat. Oh my God. Coming like a Hellcat. But, um, where was I? Hold on. So, guys, there's one thing I actually want to check out before I actually continue talking about that thing. Is, I want to check out this room. This one right here that I'm walking towards. Jeez, what is this place? Whoa! That is cool! Ring. Wow. Ring, ring. Ring. That looks just like. Ring, ring. Ring, ring. Jeez, look ring, at that. Ring, ring, ring. Ring, 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 ring. Oh my god, that looks like something from the 1940s. Ring, 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 ring. ring I wish I could show you guys over here. There's like a poster and it says, We've done Europe, Asia, even Africa. This year, America. Amtrak. They've been across the world? Oops. I'm sorry, I was a little too loud right there. One of you guys down in the comments wanted a tour of the home and metro station. I'm really glad you asked, because I've never seen this before. I've never seen the inside of this before, and I've always wanted to. Amtrak passenger trains. I gotta be real quiet about doing this. Wow, look at that. That is so cool. Oh my gosh, that is so cool. The one thing I'm really scared of showing you guys is this Amtrak elevator because I'm worried it's going to break. But just for you guys, just for you guys who wanted this, I'm doing it. I hate this elevator more than anything though. You're going to see why here in a minute. Why I hate this Amtrak elevator. Because it's freaking haunted. And it's covered with... If it opens, that's if it even opens. I'm sorry if I'm shaking the camera a little bit, guys. Hello, Metro. I'm doing a vlog today. I will see you guys tomorrow. Gee, does this elevator work? I want to just see if it works. Oh, hell no. Nah. Oh, hell no. Nah. This thing is covered in germs. Ugh. Look, I don't like it. Oh my god. 
you see what I mean? Did you hear that? I hate that. It's moving, but it's freaking me out. Oh my god, I hate this elevator. God dang. Oh my goodness. Huh. Sorry about that short little shot, guys. I'll give you guys a little longer shot here. My goodness! Somebody left their Taco Bell. It's probably having the squirts in the bathroom over here. Probably having explosive diarrhea. Ugh. Probably just probably went out behind the station and just let one rip. Now the whole back of the station is covered in diarrhea. Or maybe you did it right there. That looks like that looks like it. I'm sorry guys, I'm sorry I'm grossing you out. I'm sorry. That's just that's just boy humor. Okay? It's just boy humor. Y'all know it's boy humor. Let's do the last elevator, the one that smelled like a skunk last time. Somebody pissed in the elevator. What the fuck is that? Nope. Somebody pissed in the elevator. Nope. I'm not doing that. I just want to show you guys how far we can get. I don't think I've ever done, maybe I've done this once. I don't, I don't remember if I've ever shown you guys how far. Oh God, I just burped. That was my ravioli from this morning. Oh God, that came up. Oh, hi motorcyclist, how are you? That's a, that's a Harley Davidson. I really hope he turns down my way. Yep, he's coming. Here he comes. Oh, God, look at that motorcycle. Oh, here goes another one. I don't know why they look at me so weird. I've started a vlog over here once. There he goes, he's pulling back out again. Oh my god, I feel like I just walked 20 I feel like I just walked 20 miles. But I didn't. See that. I'm lazy. 
I'm actually not lazy, but when I sit down, I like to act like I'm lazy because it feels so good to sit down, especially when you have scoliosis. God. Yes, I do have scoliosis if you're wondering. Look at that blueberry. Oh my God, look at that blueberry. Oh my God. Uh, 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 oh my God. Where is this train? Look at that Hummer. Bruh. Look oh at this goodness. dude. <laughs> Wait till you see the. <laughs> Well, guys, this is Walker Vlog. I'll see that train tomorrow. Probably will be out of here by tonight anyway. So I'll see it when it comes back in some other time. Even if it's an IC, I'll be in a sa Oh my god, what do I have on my foot? Do I have a blister? Oh my goodness. I just feel like I, uh, I don't know. Oh! These shoes are starting to get a little too big for me, little too small. I'll just show you guys. Oh yeah, and this is for Water Galaxy. Sorry for double pausing, it's the wind. It's the wind, it's not me. Oh my god. Well anyway, I gotta edit here in the next uh, two minutes, guys. So, um, I'm gonna start wrapping it up now. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys... If you guys like this video, smash the like button, turn on the notification bell, subscribe, and I will see you guys in the next walking vlog on Wednesday. So, um, this is what I mean by Sunday vlogs. It means I'm really out of it. But, um, until this coronavirus clears up, walking vlogs will be on Sundays, Wednesdays, and Thursdays. But when coronavirus clears up, they're only going to be on Wednesdays and Thursdays. So this is just a temporary schedule. And for Metra, on the other hand, Metra's schedule will be back to the five-day schedule. And I might actually just change that from Wednesdays and Thursdays to... Uh, I don't know when I'll do a walking vlog. Maybe I'll do it on... Be better to do it on a Sunday. Okay. Yeah, I'd be better to do it on Sundays. Because Metro's only run every two hours on Sundays and the trains aren't that active on Sundays right now. But we'll just see in the future. We'll just see in the near future. Anyway. See you guys on the next one later. Love you all. Peace. And bye.